Imagine you start with just $100 and over time, that money grows into thousands of dollars. This magic happens through something called compounding. Compounding is when your money earns interest or returns, and then those earnings start earning more money on top of that. It's like a snowball rolling down a hill, getting bigger and bigger as it goes. The longer you let it roll, the more powerful it becomes. Whether you're saving for a house, retirement, or just want to build wealth, compounding is your best friend. In this video, we'll explore six of the best compounding assets you can start investing in right now. These are simple, effective ways to make your money work harder for you, helping you grow your wealth over time. Let's dive in and see how you can make compounding work for you. Number one, high yield savings accounts, the safe start. A high yield savings account is one of the easiest and safest ways to start growing your money. Unlike regular savings accounts, which offer very low interest rates, high yield savings accounts pay you more interest on the money you deposit. This means your money grows faster even if you don't add anything extra. Here's how it works. You put your money into the account and the bank pays you interest on it. Every month, that interest gets added to your balance. The best part? The next month, you earn interest on your new, larger balance. Over time, this creates a compounding effect where your money grows more and more without you having to do anything. High yield savings accounts are also very low risk. Your money is safe because it's protected by the government up to a certain amount. This makes it a great option for anyone who wants to start investing without taking big risks. While it might not make you rich overnight, it's a reliable way to grow your savings steadily and securely. Number 2. Dividend Stocks – Earning While You Hold Dividend stocks are a smart way to invest because they pay you regularly just for holding them. When you buy a dividend stock, you're buying a small piece of a company. These companies share a portion of their profits with shareholders like you by paying dividends, which is money you receive without selling your stocks. Here's the exciting part. If you reinvest those dividends, you can buy more shares of the stock. More shares mean more dividends in the future, which you can reinvest again. This creates a powerful compounding effect where your earnings keep growing over time. The longer you hold on to these stocks, the more money you can make from dividends alone without doing anything extra. A famous example of someone who loves dividend stocks is Warren Buffett. He is one of the world's most successful investors and has built much of his wealth by investing in solid companies that pay dividends. Buffett often reinvests his dividends, allowing his money to grow steadily over time. Dividend stocks are especially attractive because they offer two ways to make money, through the regular dividend payments and by the stock price increasing over time. Many dividend paying companies are large, stable businesses, which means they're less likely to be risky investments. To start, you can look at companies in sectors like utilities, consumer goods, or healthcare. These companies often have a history of paying consistent dividends. Investing in dividend stocks is a great way to earn money while you hold on to your investments. Over time, the compounding effect of reinvested dividends can help you build significant wealth, making dividend stocks a key part of any long-term investment strategy. Number three. Real Estate – Building Wealth Brick by Brick Real estate is one of the oldest and most reliable ways to build wealth over time. When you invest in real estate, you're buying property, like a house, an apartment, or even commercial buildings. The value of real estate tends to go up over time, which means the property you buy today could be worth a lot more in the future. One of the biggest benefits of real estate is that it can provide you with a steady income. If you rent out your property, you can collect rent every month. This rental income can be reinvested, either by paying off the mortgage faster or by saving to buy more properties. Over time, this can create a powerful compounding effect, where the income from one property helps you acquire more, leading to even more income. Real estate also offers other advantages. For example, you can benefit from tax breaks that make owning property more affordable. Plus. Once the mortgage is paid off, the rent you collect becomes pure profit, adding to your wealth. There are different ways to invest in real estate. You can buy residential properties like single-family homes or go for commercial properties like office buildings or shops. If you don't want to manage properties directly, you can invest in real estate investment trusts REITs, which are companies that own and manage properties. REITs allow you to invest in real estate without having to buy or manage any property yourself. Investing in real estate is a long-term strategy, but it can be very rewarding. 
By carefully selecting properties and reinvesting your earnings, you can build wealth brick by brick, creating a solid foundation for your financial future. Number four, stock market, the growth engine. The stock market is one of the most powerful tools for growing your money over time. When you invest in the stock market, you're buying shares of companies. As these companies grow and become more profitable, the value of your shares increases, which means your investment grows too. One of the biggest advantages of the stock market is its potential for long-term growth. While the market can go up and down in the short term, it has historically gone up over the long term. This makes it a great way to build wealth if you're patient and willing to invest for several years or even decades. Compounding plays a big role in stock market growth. If you reinvest the profits you make from selling stocks or the dividends you earn from holding them, you can buy more shares. Over time, this means you own more of the companies you've invested in, which can lead to even bigger profits in the future. Diversification is also important when investing in the stock market. This means spreading your investments across different companies, industries, and even countries. By doing this, you reduce the risk of losing money if one company or industry doesn't do well. Diversifying helps ensure that your overall investment portfolio grows steadily. To start investing in the stock market, you don't need a lot of money. You can begin with small amounts and gradually build up your investment. The key is to start as early as possible so your money has more time to grow. The stock market is often called the growth engine because of its ability to turn small investments into large sums over time. With patience and smart investing, the stock market can help you achieve your financial goals and secure your future. Number five, ETFs, the easy way to diversify. ETFs or exchange traded funds are a simple and popular way to invest in the stock market. An ETF is like a basket of different stocks, bonds, or other assets. When you buy a share of an ETF, you're actually buying a small piece of all the assets in that basket. This makes ETFs a great way to diversify your investments without having to buy lots of different individual stocks or bonds. One of the best things about ETFs is that they are easy to manage. You don't need to worry about picking the right stocks yourself because the ETF already includes a variety of them. This helps spread out your risk because if one stock in the ETF doesn't do well, the others can help balance it out. ETFs also often have lower fees compared to other types of investments, like mutual funds. This means more of your money goes into your investment rather than being eaten up by costs. Another benefit is that many ETFs automatically reinvest any dividends they earn, which helps your investment grow over time through compounding. Whether you're a beginner or an experienced investor, ETFs offer a simple and effective way to diversify your portfolio and take advantage of the stock market's growth potential. Number six, bonds, the steady compounder. Bonds are a reliable and steady way to grow your money over time. When you buy a bond, you're essentially lending money to a government or a company. In return, they promise to pay you interest on that loan regularly and when the bond matures, they give you back the full amount you lent. One of the key benefits of bonds is their stability. Unlike stocks, which can be volatile and go up and down in value, bonds are generally safer and provide a steady stream of income. This makes them a good choice for people who want to protect their money while still earning a return. The power of compounding comes into play when you reinvest the interest you earn from bonds. By using the interest payments to buy more bonds, you can gradually increase your investment and watch it grow over time. This steady compounding can be a great way to build wealth, especially if you're looking for a low risk option. There are different types of bonds, such as government bonds, corporate bonds, and municipal bonds. Each type has its own level of risk and return, so it's important to choose the one that fits your financial goals. Bonds may not offer the high returns of stocks, but they are a solid way to earn steady, compounded growth, making them an important part of a balanced investment portfolio. Compounding is a powerful tool that can help you grow your wealth over time, whether you're just starting out or already investing. The key is to start as early as possible, even if you can only invest a small amount at first. The sooner you begin, the more time your money has to grow. Remember, building wealth isn't about making quick money. It's about being patient and letting your investments grow steadily over time. By choosing the right assets and reinvesting your earnings, you can create a solid financial foundation for your future. So take that first step today and your future self will thank you for it.
Now, if you want to learn how to achieve financial success, then watch this video next. And if you made it to this point of the video, please like and subscribe to the channel to see more content like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.